Hey guys, Toby here and today I want to show you how to beat Ratziel the Shepherd. You can find him at the Dunley Monastery in the church. First off, you have to create a Holy Resistance Potion to enter this area because otherwise you will take too much passive damage. To craft that you will need Scorch Stones. You can find those, you can find those in the Iron Mine or at the Church of Damned when you defeat those skeleton guys. So to the boss fight itself, um, I did clear out the area and I would recommend you to do so too because you have way more space to dodge his abilities on this side than on the other one where there are obstacles that you cannot clear out before starting to fight. To his abilities, he has that uh, crimson beam that's just a laser beam in one direction and that does damage with each tick. Then he's spawning those little relics and those relics they give him a shield I think and they also root you should you come in place to them so you can kill them but if you think you have enough space to kill him you can also just leave them up but I think it's easier to kill them it's like three auto attacks on level uh, 60. Then he has also his uh, holy bolt that's just a projectile and on impact it will explode in an area of effect. He has also an AOE Nova around him and also those AOE attacks. Here you can see if you come too close to those relics, you will be rooted in place. So yeah, I would say it's more helpful to kill those immediately. I'm aware that uh, I'm a way higher level than him, but I still think this is helpful because you see all his abilities and know what to do and how to handle the boss. I did not mean to prove that I can kill this boss on level 76 or whatever. I just wanted to showcase how to do him and what you need to do him. And yeah, that was the Shepherd. After defeating him, you unlock some crucial things. Starting with the Crimson Beam, a new ultimate ability that does exactly the same than he did. And then the Ateneum, Silver Resistance Potion, and the Corrupted Artifact. As always, thanks for watching. Please consider like and subscribe, and I hope we see each other again.